Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and thank you for coming back. So today's video is going to be in English because there's two reasons. First reason is that I want Dan to understand this video because it's about his birthday surprise and the second reason is that I really want to feel more comfortable speaking English in front of the camera so I decided I will practice in this video so remember English is not my first language so there will be probably few mistakes. Show me a piece of your heart, a piece of your love I'm calling you up to get down, down, down The way that we touch is never enough I'm turning you up to get down, down Show me a piece of your heart, a piece of your love I'm calling you up to get down, down, down The way that we touch is never enough I'm turning you up to get down, 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 down. So it's Dan's birthday next week and I decided to make a little surprise for him. Um, 2020 was quite a strange year and uh, Dan was supporting me a lot when I couldn't see my family. Uh, we were talking a lot, we got really really close together and uh, he's a fantastic boyfriend. So I want to show him how much he means to me and make a beautiful surprise for him for his birthday and I hope he will like it. So his main present will be trip away that he doesn't know about and I'm just taking him a week after his birthday to the beautiful place I'll show you in a minute but um, me and Dan absolutely love traveling and 2020 wasn't the easiest year to travel to be fair so we didn't travel at all this year and uh, I know that he really wants to go somewhere so I decided to book this place where I found it I was completely in love with this because I knew that Dan will love it so I thought that I want this birthday present to last more than one day I want this to last forever in his memories so this is why I booked trip away to the place that I hope and I think that he will really really love and then I got a few little surprises for him so basically he will have to find his own presents on his own by finding some rhymes about the place where the presents are I don't know if that makes sense but you will see it later basically making rhymes in English was probably the hardest part of the surprise because English is not my first language and making crimes in English about places where he will find his presence was a real challenge, trust me. Right now I'm gonna tell you about this place where we go to because I feel like it's meant to be. So I found this completely unreal place on the internet and I wanted to check if they have any availabilities uh, for the next weeks and it's turned out that they are fully booked until mid-2021. And the only one available date for this year was uh, the week after his birthday. So I was completely shocked and I thought, all right, let's book it straight away. I just booked the same day I found it. I just booked it because I know it will be gone soon and there is no other date that I'll, are available close to his birthday. So I always think that Dan like things that are really unique and I could take him away to the hotel, to beautiful hotel room, but I thought that better idea is to find something really unique. So I found this amazing tree house. What I absolutely love about this place is that it has hot tub outside. So even though his birthday is in October and it's cold outside, you can still stay warm sit in this hot tub, drink our champagne and relax, then we can go back to the treehouse, relax by the fireplace and just really feel cozy and warm even though it's autumn. So I think that this will be also a place when we can really, really relax because if you are in the treehouse, in the forest, you have this beautiful nature around you. It's a perfect place just to get your energy back, just relax. And that's what I want for his birthday. I just want him to completely relax, just enjoy the moment and make beautiful memories. That's the main present and I hope that he doesn't expect at all that I'm taking him away. But um, except this booking trip and um, taking him away, I also have few little surprises that I, want, I wanted to show him that 
he really means a lot to me and that I really care. I'll show you what I already got for him because there is few things that I already got him and I'm just hiding this in the house. And there's one thing I need to get and it's his favorite champagne. So when he's at work, I just need to go to the shop and get this champagne and then will be everything sorted. So let me show you real quick what I have in here. I ordered these Polaroid photos in Poland and I brought them with me to England. As you can see, all of them are connected with traveling as me and Dan absolutely love traveling together. And this is our passion. So here is our photo with passports. This is us in the plane uh, with backpacks, again, traveling on the boat airport selfie and uh, what I'm gonna do with these photos I'm gonna put them on this string that I also bought in Poland and brought it with me uh, I'm gonna use this PEX to do it well PEX is a new word for me but I guess this is PEX so <laughs> every time I learn something new uh, and also what I'm gonna do is um, write some nice things about traveling and love with this permanent pen so yeah, that's the part of surprise for Dan. Well, let me show you what just arrived. I just opened this and I absolutely love it. So, instead of birthday card, I decided to make it a little bit adventurous for Dan. So here is his birthday card that he will find. And basically it says, we are going on a little trip away, guess where? And this is a scratch card. It's not a normal card, it's scratch card. So here you have five photos of the destination we are going to so when he scratch one he will see one photo of the place then he will see some other part of this place and uh, in the end he will see where are we going from all of these pictures so uh, and it says in the end happy birthday so that will be the final step of the birthday surprise uh, because I think that he doesn't expect that we are going away so yeah that's instead of the traditional birthday card. And here I have little gold envelopes, so Dan will have to find them to know where uh, is his next present. Right guys, we are in uh, Dan's family lodge and today is his birthday and I need to speak very quiet so he doesn't hear me, but basically I'm just gonna prepare everything now. I just closed him in the other room and said, just don't go out. Well, I had to do it. <laughs> So last time Dan mentioned that he doesn't like birthday cakes, so this is his birthday cake, which is his favorite carrot cake. And he will find this little note that will just tell him where is his main present. It gets cold behind your door, I'll make a sound and make you feel warm. So it's if it's not a heater, what did we use yesterday to the fireplace? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, carrot cake! Yay, carrot cake! Thank <laughs> like you, like! Can I have some of this? Yes, we just have it now, so. Cheers. Cheers, baby. Oh, mint. <laughs> I can't remember when they were in that. Yeah. <laughs> so many good memories. Yeah. So right, I'm getting distracted. Oh, there we go. Oh! Uh... <laughs> right, I'm feeling a bit worse. If you ever feel hungry, come to me or you will be angry. What's <laughs> that? If you ever feel hungry, come to me or you will be hungry. It's got to be, be over there somewhere. Yeah. Take your champagne, please. Sorry, boss. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. I'm really happy that you got me carrot cake. What's the first thing if you're hungry? Fridge. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Yeah, there's another one. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Yeah. Many times you have seen a good movie on my screen. Your laptop. I thought this will be the hardest one. The laptop. I thought you would say TV, but we actually haven't seen it. This is I love you. This is fun. We're going on a little trip away, guess where? Scratch one of the circles for some clues. <laughs> <laughs> so you have to scratch it? What one circle I can scratch them all? Scratch them all. This is class. So if you got this is better than the one I did. <laughs> Hope you can see anything on it. Looks like a little log cabin or something. Mm -hmm. I should have started at the beginning, shouldn't Doesn't I? Doesn't matter. What's that? Is that a, tr is that a tree house? Yes! Like a tree out of log cabin somewhere. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do you like what you see? Oh, is that a hot tub? Yeah, it has a hot tub. So we are going next week on Friday to the tree house. Are you happy? <laughs> I can't wait. I'll show you. <laughs> oh, man, that we're planning I know, I was thinking, oh god, let me show you photos on Monday. And, yeah, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, I think that we'll take this champagne there and those two. So good, I can't wait. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> and that's the scratch card, and here you have all the photos of the destination we go to. So you can't see it properly in here, but you will see it definitely on um, our Instagrams <laughs> when we go there, we will show it. Yeah, but that's so cool. You just scratch it and then you have mm, the places you go to and you have to guess where it is. But don't guess, it's a tree. The celebration continues. We're just going out for some drinks and some meal. Are you ready for drinks?